all right so we're back again with another video and today we're actually going to be doing some headlight restoration because as you can see these things are pretty fogged up uh they haven't been cleaned or anything looks like from since the 90s this was a 99 basically i'm gonna be trying out this rain x headlight restoration kit and it comes with the drill attachment i have my drill right here beside me so that's one thing you're gonna need 1500 gray sanding disc 3200 and 4000 gray and then uh, a polishing pad and then some polish and that kind of stuff so we're gonna open this thing up and see they even gave you some gloves because of the little polishing pad thing that they have uh, at the end to seal in all the work that we're gonna do uh, you're gonna need to put on gloves for that so that's good that they included this the little drill attachment the protectant stuff, the buffing polish, some instructions for those of y'all who are going to need the instructions, but I pretty much think I know what I'm going to be doing. And the sanding disc. Oh, and the polisher. But let's go ahead and get started with this. Alright, so I'm only going to do the driver's side light as of now so I can show you the difference between this one and this one whenever I finish. As you can see, they both still look hazed up. But pretty much I'm going to be doing just like I did with the carbon fiber on my Genesis in my last video. If you haven't watched it, then go ahead and click on this card right here at the top of the screen. But uh, yeah, I'm going to be wet sanding this with 1500 grit first. And uh, I have my spray bottle right here. I'm going to go ahead and spray it down and get to wet sanding. So this is pretty hard to use. I'm not even gonna lie uh i cannot use that drill in order to wet sand this thing it was just going like i don't know i couldn't control it really but if uh if you do get this kit then you probably could do a little better than i can with it but i couldn't do it so uh, i just got my thousand grit sandpaper and my three thousand grit and i went on here to sand sanded this headlight and this is how it came out so far it does have a haze to it but compared to this one it's not as bad let me step back so y'all can see them both it's still pretty bad but it's not as bad as the passenger side so now i'm just gonna go ahead and start to polishing this thing because it is like i mean it's smooth but it wasn't necessarily unsmooth whenever i first started but now i'm gonna see if it's a little easier to use this polishing pad on it now uh with the drill so fingers crossed on that. I'm not even about to stunt like I'm a pro with the drill, but uh, this thing, it does look a lot better than this side, as you can tell. So I wouldn't say the kit is a fail just because, I mean, if you don't have access to 
uh, specific tools or uh, if you don't have access to a hardware store or something like that then uh, you might have access to a drill I don't know but it's good that they did put the drill bit in here for people who you know just need a kit in order to just be able to do it by themselves at home but me personally I would just use sandpaper to be honest the polish that they have in here is actually not bad so I mean there it is on this side I didn't put the little ceiling on there I'm probably gonna go over this side again with the polish and then do it all again on this side I'm not gonna record that just because I'm running out of daylight but I'll show y'all the finished product whenever I'm done with that I'm not even gonna lie, like I'm not so glad I did that. Dang, bro, these things a lot more shiny than they were. Like, look at this. You can see through them, actually. At first, you couldn't even see through them, especially this one. But, I mean, I'm all done with it now. I put the uh, protecting stuff on it. And the little protectant that I put on it with the little wipe at the end, it said to not let it get into any moisture, like within the next eight hours or so. And so, uh, yeah, I think I'm just gonna leave it out here and not drive it. It's not supposed to rain tomorrow, so it should be good by in the morning. But I think it's a pretty good, uh, pretty good thing I did that. Like, dang, bro, I can't stop looking at it. It look real good. I just need to work on getting this bumper put back on there. And about that, I'm actually almost ready to paint this thing. So I need to know uh, paint comments in the section below because uh, I need to know what color I'm gonna paint this thing. I'm gonna start doing the body work and everything and uh, and start prepping it up for paint pretty soon, but not until I get some picked out. And if you see the calipers, they orange. So I'm thinking something along the bluer color scheme, maybe red, something like that. But uh, just let me know in the comments, in the comments. But yeah, I'm about to go ahead and end this video right here. So if you like the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Leave some positive vibes in the comment section below and I'll catch y'all in the next video. But always remember to do more, be more, believe more, and achieve more. And I thank y'all for watching.